Hi folks, we're out in York at the moment. We fancy a bit of street food. Oh yes. And we're going for a little bit of Greek show, aren't we? That's it. Let's have a look at this uh, street food truck and see what they do. See you in a minute. It's amazing what food they push out of these little trucks now, isn't it? Oh look, Greek there, yeah, look. Yeah, look, gyros and pit of wraps there. Greek one, we love them out in Cyprus, didn't we, Sharon? We did, I don't know where we are. I bet they're good and all. Is it worth getting one or what? Well, one fish and chips, or do you want that? You've got to make your mind up. I don't know, Sha. I like That's the idea of street food, you see. We can have fish and chips anytime, as you well know. We might yeah. even have fish and chips tomorrow. Do you fancy a gyro or what? A gyro. Hey, not, not a gyro, what you used to get when you was unemployed, Sharon. Not that sort of gyro. Let's have a look. Have, have a close look, folks. I'll have a chicken box. You want a chicken box? Yes. Chicken gyro box, please. Yeah. And uh, can I have a pork wrap, please? Chicken box and a chicken wrap. No, pork wrap. Wrap? Pork oh, wrap. Yeah. Pork wrap. All freshly cooked, folks, as you can see. So I've gone for the chicken box, which is uh, marinated chicken to see key fries and salad in uh, a warm fritter in can the box. And Sharon's gone for the pork wrap, Sharon, didn't you? Yeah. So that's what Sharon's got there. All fresh as well, folks, as you can see. All cooked to order. And I do love a bit of salad. size of that show. Look at the size of your wrap. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, it's hot. Yeah, I'm going to put some uh, chip seasoning. Is it chip seasoning? Yeah. Yeah, on me uh, chips. They did ask, folks, so uh, you don't have to have it if you don't like it. What's your blog name then? Butler's Empire. Is it on YouTube? Oh, yes. Check it out. It's a foodie channel. How many forks have you got for me? Yeah, we'll I mean, what? Forks. Sports. Forks. I can't eat them. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have a fork, yes, please. Brilliant. Thanks very much. In case you dribble. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, no doubt I will. Looking at that, it looks lovely. <laughs> there you go. Brilliant. Thank have you very much. Thank, Thank you. Bye bye. bye. Right, just got a little seat. Let's have a little look at what you've got here. You went for the pork one, Sharon, didn't yeah. you? Yeah. Look how filled that is, folks. Look. Go on, in you go, Sharon. Mm. What you got there? Chips in it as well, look. You got chips in there as well? Mm. That looks nice. absolutely superb. Go on, baby. Right, let's have a look at my little box here, folks. Got myself a little fork as well. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, look at that, look. How colourful is that, folks? All right. Look at that, you got the old chip spice on there. Mmm. Look at that. Everything's there, folks. Fresh salad. Let's try this chicken. Look, lovely crispy bits. Huh. Mmm. Get on fries. This will be the uh, tzatziki, Sharon, which is like a sour cream with little bits of cucumber in. That is so light. And what I like to do is just get a bit of that, put that on there like that, Sharon. Get a bit of tomato, maybe. Why don't you put the box down to it with your fingers? It's so much easier. I love it, Cher. Yeah, I'll bit of that. Bit of that. I'm going to fold that over and go full metal jacket on that. Mmm. That, my friends is a taste sensation. Happy days. It's not.
not my fault You've been lying, saying that I took away your peace Drowning by yourself I'm so good You wanna blame me Like you have no options I ain't take your options mm. Now I'm not the problem Man, that's on you, yeah You've been terrorizing me Yeah, I'm always wrong I knew you lost your mind When you dropped that bomb Girl, are you crazy? Let's try a bit of onion this time Yeah, you must be crazy I've been thinking lately Shovel that on there It's you Look at that Put it on me I like a rat, but take your stuff back. Maybe it's you. Right, we're going to finish this off, folks, and we'll tell you what we think of it at the end. See you in a minute. Right, I've nearly finished, folks, and uh, it was very, very tasty. I've done away with that because it's easier to do it with your fingers. So, if you do order the box like I did, be prepared for a little bit messy. Sharon's finished hers. Lovely. Right. Always handy to get plenty of extra napkins, folks, for your hands as well as your gob. So, what did I think of that? Very, very tasty. You do get more in the box than you do in the wrap, but you're, it's a lot more messy. So the little fork, the little wooden fork, felt a bit uncomfortable actually. It drew your mouth because it's not plastic or metal. It sort of dragged your mouth when you was uh, pulling the fork out. Plus it kept, there's no sides on it. It would have been better with a spoon to be honest with you. So out of 10, I'd probably give that a good seven. Seven's a good score. Bearing in mind 10 is a top Greek proper one out in Greece, for example. And what did you think, baby? What, what was your opinion? I enjoyed it. It was very tasty. The pork was lovely and tender. I'd give it a seven as well, but I'm still hungry. You're still hungry? Mm. Whereas I'm not. Yeah. So for yours was nine pound. Yeah. Mine was 12 pound. You can spend an extra three pound and get pork and chicken. Depends if you want to go that far. 15 pounds quite a lot of money for mm. a bit of street food. But I normally say about 10 pound I would normally pay for sort of street food, something like that. But all in all, seven out of ten. Very nice. Very bad. tasty, though. Very tasty. Yeah, very tasty. Anyway, that's just our opinion. If you if you're in the York area, this do give it a go. In the shopping square, isn't it? Yeah, really? in the main shopping square. So uh, I, put, I would imagine they're here all the time. Anyway, there you go. I hope you've enjoyed that one. Thanks very much for watching, and uh, we'll see you in the next video. And until then, bye. Bye for now. <laughs>